Hi guys, it's Kian. So welcome back to this week's video. Um, I'll be unboxing some Ash and Noon eyes that I ordered with my friend. So let's just get into it. So this order I made with my friend, there are four pairs of eyes in total. Two of them are mine and two of them are my friends. So I'll be showing you all the eyes, but I will only be trying the eyes that uh, are mine because um, yeah, the other two pairs belong to my friend. So these are how the eyes look like in their boxes. The boxes are actually really nice. Um, you can see that the Ash and Noon logo is glossy and reflective and yeah they just come in pretty simple black boxes which are quite common um, for urethane eyes. So the first pair that I have is Golden Snake. So this is a pair that I bought and it is in the Meow style. So that's like the basic style of Fashion Noon Eyes. So I got the 14mm Narrow Iris. Um, and yeah, you can see me struggling to take the eyes out and just removing the foam to do it all together. So the eyes are actually um, quite distinctly coloured. So I got Golden Snake because it has both um, kind of like a golden yellow and also a bit of a greyish colour. And you can see that it's um, quite... I don't know whether this is quite high dome, but it is, you know, not a low dome kind of eyes from the side. So that's what the 14mm narrow iris look like. The narrow iris is supposed to be about 6mm for the iris. Um, at least that's what's listed on Ash and Noon's website. So here you can see on the left, it's worn with the black rim below, and on the right, it's worn with the white rim below. So this is um, when the black part of the iris is shown on the bottom. And this is Pepper, my Switch Ruzo modeling the eyes. Well, I mean, technically it's going to be his eyes, so um, yeah, I'm just basically trying it on. So this is if I show more of the white rim on the bottom. It looks a bit lighter because of the way the pupil is the pupil? The iris? The, the way the iris is placed. So because it's cat eye pupil, so it's a slit pupil, there's basically only two ways that you can really place it unless you want to have horizontal eye slit. So the next pair is also mine. It's the Mercury, the color Mercury, and it's in the style Starry Night. So Starry Night is... um. A style that has a bit more of a shiny pore, so it's meant to be a bit more reflective, especially in like darker conditions. So I thought that that would go really nice with Mercury because it's kind of like silver. Yeah, so I think I think this works really well with the Starry Night style. And there's a tiny bit of blue in the reflections, if you can see. Um, but yeah, I really like this pair of eyes because they're very reflective. And here it is in vibe, worn two ways. Uh, on the left, we have the black rim on the bottom, and on the right, the white rim on the bottom. So this is when the black rim is on the bottom. It's kind of more, I guess, distinct because the black rim kind of gives it um, an outline. And it feels a bit more like I don't know, the way I think of it is like it feels a bit more like he's drawn like an anime kind of style. Like his eyes are a bit more drawn on. And next we have uh, showing the white side of the rim on the bottom. So I think this suits what I have in mind for Vi better and this is what he, the orientation of the eyes that he'll be wearing. Um, yeah, they look really really reflective. And it's really good because Vi kind of has dark eye wells. So yeah, if your doll has this kind of issue, this kind of shiny eyes might be a good uh, choice for your dolls. So these are also in the 14mm small narrow iris. And the third pair that I'm unboxing is Daisy in August W01 in uh, 14mm narrow iris. This pair belongs to my friend, so I will only be showing you what it looks like. 
This pair has round pupils and it's kind of like a very pale blue. There's quite a few colors in the rim and also around the pupil. It's a very interesting color gradation. Yeah, if that's what you call it. So, um, yeah, I think they will look great in the doll. Just that I can't try it on because it's not my eyes. <laughs> So the fourth and last pair that I'm showing you today is the Daisy in August original. And this is the only pair that's in a different, slightly different size. It's 14mm, so it's the original size iris, which I believe is 7.4mm for the pupil size. You can see that it's the pupil is taking up visibly more space than the narrow iris one. Um, and the blue in this case is a bit more vivid, I guess. Yeah, so it I'm quite curious what this pair looks like in a doll. Um, and here is a comparison of the narrow iris with the regular iris size. I think it's quite uh, visible, <laughs> the difference. And here are all the four pairs, two of which are mine and two of which are my friends. As well as what they look like from the side. So you can see that the regular pupil actually has a much bigger dome. just you know, because the pupil is a bigger size. And another close-up of what the eyes look like. So, if you enjoyed today's video, please like this video and maybe share with a friend. Thank you for watching and I'll see you all next time. Bye!